I move to my main phase one. I cast my commander. I concede. Welcome back to another day in the arena. It's me, it's CGB, and it's Bony Brawl, baby. Bony Paul Clearcutter is a Simic Commander. It is six mana for a six five reach giant scout. When it enters the battlefield, you create Boo, a blue ox creature token with power and toughness equal to the number of lands you control. Whenever you attack at all, for some reason, draw a card, and then you may put a land card from your hand or graveyard onto the battlefield. It's Simic, it's lands, it's big, powerful monsters. We get to play cards that aren't usually as good in a, just a typical brawl environment. Cards like Verdant Rejuvenation, Last March of the Ends. Cards like, uh, where, they, where did they go? Where's my, where's my nonsense? This nonsense, uh, Vaultborn Tyrant. Just these really expensive big time payoffs that reward you for having like a really powerful creature because if usually the opponent sees your commander, they kill your commander. When you play Bony Paul, they've got to kill two things. So more often than not, you actually get some payoff from your giant monsters. So if you like Simic big mana decks and you like Brawl as much as I do, I think you'll really enjoy this deck. One thing to note that this video was recorded live before the enemy fetches came out. So get your Misty Rainforest into the deck. And other than that, go out there and have fun. Enjoy the Brawl content. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see, nope, that's in the outro. God, what do I do? I've lost my touch. Let's dive in. Let the nonsense begin. Um, wow, what an unkeepable hand. Better, closer, warmer. The fetch land can have some utility, so let's see if we can hold it for that utility. Mortuary. Wow, Moldrotha, grindy, grindy, grindy. Look at them filling their graveyard already. When I find scavenger grounds, they gonna cry. Punchies. So I don't have a play this turn. Let's see if we can find one. Sure. I might have to fetch an untapped land because of that attack, but we'll see. Yeah, may as well. Cultivate, good card. Let's see if they still have land. Sure do. Ooh, a Lotus Field, okay. Uh, how do I blow that up or copy it or control it? <laughs> I want something sneaky. All right, if we get deserts here, we get the Zombos. Let's do it. Do we have something down there we want to return? We could get our Surveil Land back. This is unlikely to be useful. We're not getting cavern, but I think that's okay here. Because we're putting pressure on them. Pressure is good. Mm -hmm. God's unwanted child. <laughs> okay. Sunday fun day. Hope you're enjoying Michigan heat wave. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Enjoyed 80 degree weather in Kalamazoo yesterday. Pretty wild. We doing this? We doing this? Protected, by the way. Beautiful. Wait, from my graveyard? I didn't even know that part of the card. Are you kidding? From the graveyard? 
That's insane. This card is busted. <laughs> My first time trying to cast it and Bolas took it away from me. What a scumbag. Time to edit the deck. Why? Look at us. We're unbeatable. The only thing that can beat us is our own commander. <laughs> I'm a bad, bad, bad man. Give me the gate. Shouldn't have played that, right? Because then Settle would have hit me something good. Oh, well. I'm getting better. I'll be fine. I'm going to Magic the Gathering so hard. Oof! Two? They're down to two. And we've got a Hall of the Storm Giants on board. Yeah. Opponent's GGing. Weak. Pathetic. I will show you how great I am at this game by shoving your mind slaver where the sun don't shine. Boom. I bosage you. Just smash. <laughs> Nasty. Nasty. What a, what a, what a beating. Ooh, we have to have like lands in our graveyard. We have to get lands out of our graveyard. It's like, it's kind of like easy. It's, it's too easy, right? <laughs> the Mesa Falcon nest. I don't know. I like being a gang. <laughs> the Mesa Falcon gang. Club Falcon. Keeps. Uh oh. <laughs> Never didn't have it. First sliver. What a deck. Who here likes the first sliver? We got any first sliver fans? We got any first sliver enjoyers willing to own up to it in front of the world? See, I don't think I counter the sliver. I think I counter what comes after the sliver. I think that's the play here. Key. Sure. Doppelgang on key is going to be fun. That's a pretty good card. <laughs> You're going to deal with that. All right. What do we have down there? Nothing to archway. Although archway is a heck of a hit here. And then do we take cavern? Are they actually going to counter my commander? Are they going to counter anything? I don't think they are. But I don't know if I can do better. Oh, yeah, we get this because more... They're going to kill this Titan for sure. Yeah, there's no way I actually get to do that. Wrong matchup. Uh, I guess it should be Cavern just to be sure, right? Just to be sure. Scout. Give me back Coast. We could get another Scry off the Temple. I think it's coast. I think I'm going to want untapped lands. Oh, I still had a land drop this turn. I forgot about that. So that could have been get back temple and scry. Ah, ha, ha, smarties. 
You can also get Boseju and bounce it, just like in modern. That's technology right there. Oh, look at this master of the game. <gasps> Ice cold. Ice cold is in fact cooler than being cool. They have three mana. I don't think they run counter spells, but let's see. Blue, blue, blue. Yeah, we can't hold up mana drain and cast this. I think it's this. How many deserts we got? One, two. We just need one desert for Zombos. Then we got some blockers for this first sliver. That's fine. That's fine. We're trying to sell them that we don't have this. We want them to go for a big spell like an ultimatum. But how about that? They do run counter spell in first sliver. Most players won't do that. Yeah! Yeah! The setup, baby. The setup. They were like, no way they have that. Oh, we do. Oh, we freaking do. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. 13, 14, 15, 16. Uh, so five? No, four. It's one short of five. I will try to pay five just in case. Did they know? Did they know? Nothing in Brawl, nothing screams Brawl and Magic the Gathering more than mental weakness. <laughs> Such a fact. So true. Uh, that's a keeper, right? It's a keeper. Mana Drain and I Scoop. Name a more iconic duo. Ew. I guess... Well, that's not that bad. They'll either take the Nissa, which means we curve into Kellen, or they'll take the Cultivate, which means we curve into Nissa. They are not blue, but we should do this now. Oh yeah, it's a sorcery. That's why we should do this now. You guys didn't trust me. I told you I had the setup. Hmm, this can nuke their treasures and such. But I need more mana. Am I supposed to go for mana with the Cultivate? Or a ramp deck? Right? How could we not ramp in our ramp deck? Gotta maybe draw tap land so we can cav. The Viper Fang. Other tapped creatures have Death Touch. Other untapped creatures you control have Hexproof. Okay. Six mana. If we have a big enough blocker, we don't worry about the Ravenous Ride, right? Right. Big blockers. Game on. Move. Big moo. Big freaking moo. Let's go.
Skull Spore Nexus. <laughs> Double target creature's power until end of turn. Also, whenever something dies, they get a dinosaur, right? All right, Kellen, I have a job for you. Okay, we don't want to attack with Boney. Just boo. Then we play Vaultborn, I think. Trigger. Hit. Nice. You take that. Big Tyrant. I told you it was good. I told you. Huh. Nope. Yep. Meticulous. Healy out of the Radiant Dawn. This is a... This, this card demands removal, which I don't really play. <laughs> we might have a problem here. The Growth Spiral is a great draw. Oh god, they're ramping. Alright, don't go second. It ends so badly for you. <laughs> We're so dead. Like, this game's over. They also, I think, have a Pact of Negation of their own. How big is this thing? Four, six. That's too big. That's way too big. Ugh. Ambush is close. It's not there. Elf. Bingo. Nailed it. Never didn't have it. Look at that. I guess Titan can do it, right? They packed me. I packed them back. Sounds like some kind of a song. <laughs> Definitely flipping. Come on, you're flipping. You're flipping. Yeah, you're flipping. All right. Are you an enchantment? You are an enchantment creature. The Boseju trick could do it. Boseju Archway. Hello. Hacked me. Okay. I do need blue mana. So maybe Boseju Archway is not the way. But Archway is still land drop this turn, which could be huge. Ah, it's got to be the Boseju, right? It's a way to get rid of the Heliod. I've got to do it. I've got to do it. I'll figure out the blue mana later. Besides, I like my new, tr I like knowing new tricks. New tricks are cool. Do we channel or do we ambush? If I miss on the ambush, I don't have a way to do the Boseju. I have packed, but I think they have packed too. I think the Boseju is the safe play. That's the safe play. I'm nothing if not a safe Magic the Gathering player. Free Hollowed Fountain, you're welcome. 
I am confident they're going to wrath the board. So we hold. I like all the MDFCs in this deck. I feel like I have options all the time. Take three. They're going to give me my blue source. They are. I don't like that archway. Well, don't worry. Bony Paul will get it back. Then you're really going to re regret your choices. I, I'm trying to pick you. Opponent, you have to do something about the Titan. Opponent! Opponent, the Titan will get you! We, we go to combat. I'm so nervous about a settle, I'm holding. Opponent! I tried to warn him! Uh, loot the key to everything. Sure you are. And we'll try it. I'm probably supposed to just be mulliganing for one and two mana ramp spells if I'm trying really hard. That's a good card for this deck. Really good card for this deck. Huh, not even going for it, huh? I guess they're worried that I'll counter it. I would never. We move, we move. Journey or Maze or Nissa? Nissa really good. Nissa really good. Are they gonna kill it? Maybe not. Who wants to fight? You wanna fight. Not every day you see a Jawari ruins go to war. Time warp. Pretty lucky. I'll get a new opponent. Boring. It's weird that I think we're fair magic. At least we have a turn two ramp. So let's try this. Unexpected? Eh. If they're going to flip time walks, I'm not going to, I'm, I'm just not, I'm just not rude. Had a good hand. We'll have to draw land now, but it's half our deck. Grenzo's at least interesting. It does seem like they're going to heist some really good cards from us, which is kind of scary, but it's okay. Hopefully we can cast some good cards. Really? Can't play anything here? Hmm. Okay. Grenzo is dangerous all the time because the good Brawl decks have like a lot of powerful cards. There's always at least a few. It's frustrating how fast people screw up and brawl. Get over it. Like, <laughs> no, but it, it, it's amazing how magic players who don't play commander specifically fail to realize that nobody has to play with you. <laughs> it's, it's not required. <laughs> oh, what else? 
What's the good ones in, in our situation? What's the good ones? I guess we'll get some critter land. I don't think I need a graveyard thing. At least not right now. Could get the gates that get cards, or we could just get Arazka. We don't need Cavern. Dust Bowl might be really good here. We could, this could be the game where we Dust Bowl somebody off of playing their commander. Shildred. Gross. card's pretty good but I think it's worth it here because we get to keep on our omen path journey <laughs> the theater we have the dust bowl we can sack what the Boseju? oh no they have crucius now okay they get to grenzo next turn we need to What? <laughs> Say what? Okay. Blue, blue. Nice. Yeah, quite the draw, right? Let's see if they have a go for the throat. They might. Okay. Again, bait the hook. They think it's fine now because I didn't even hesitate. I didn't do anything. I reacted to that in no way. I guess they need the mana? I'll help them with that. They shock it in. Let's go. You got plays. You got plays. They also have 10 cards in graveyard for Croxa. Something to consider. Power of promise. Five. Nah, let's go bony. The opponent expects this bony Paul. Let's live up to their expectations. See, he's blessing you. Do it. Do it. Take your Grenzo. That works. <laughs> uh, mm, yeah, sorry just uh just enjoying myself <laughs> boom i what did i just keep <laughs> oops what have i done what the hell have i done I, I saw five lands and got excited. Dude, dude, what I love about this deck is all the different lands. The land tricks are cool. Yeah, we're going to beat them to death with Lair of the Hydra, guys. It's, it's fine. This is fine. See? I know what I'm doing. Free. Oh, one. Taste it. We are now immune to your edict effect. Maze mind. I'm honestly jealous. Dude, they are on the move. Dust bowl. Do I try to dust bowl lock them? That can't be good, right? No, we're not far enough ahead to dust bowl lock them. Beep. Boop. Bro, 
good pressure. Good pressure on a Tezzeret. Now what flavor of forest shall we get? Hero? Hero? I'm Vorinclexing over here. Uh, you. Let's take, uh, you. Big sexy Clexi, what you got? They have a tapped land, no Tezzeret. Final parting, search your library for two cards, one in hand, other in graveyard. I wonder what they'll get. Ooh, what card? What card does a Tezzeret deck with a bunch of artifacts get? You think it starts with a P? Is my opponent about to dox me? Shout out to the pinal farting joke. Some things are funnier that way. So the question is, can we play Boney Paul? We'll have three legendaries, right? So we can Otawara. Yes. Yes, we can Otawara. Ancestral statue, yep. That's their it's their paradox setup. If they get this back with the Tezzeret and they just go pew 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 pew, that and Aetherflux can win the game. You don't necessarily need um a paradox engine if you have enough artifacts when you play Tezzeret if you have ancestral statue. Guys. 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 <laughs> this isn't fair. My opponents this isn't fair to my opponents, and I I never thought I'd say that. <laughs> sure. More land. Let's go. These lands are so good. Would you like to scry, or can I punch you in the face now? What can I say? Mandarin loves me. This was my Double Masters pre preview card. Preview card? Is that even the right word? Spoiler, I guess. Spoiler card. Oh, oh, not the upkeep double scry. Oh, the selection. The selection, you guys. I move to my main phase one. I cast my commander. I concede. Let's do it again. We kind of found our groove. Our opponents, we don't interact enough to keep opponents from popping off on us, but we're, we're grooving right now. Let's mull for ramp. That's one thing we've learned. This hand has ramp. We will keep. Might not be the greatest hand though. Might be name an elemental on this. Well, wouldn't be Grenzo if they didn't have turn one Thoughtseize. They take my Hydra. Rude. Good three mana play coming right up. Ah, uh, that works. We're on the move. 
That's a magic card. Jesus. Okay. We do have enough to play the Cavalier. Is there anything that's going to... You know what? They can steal a counter spell from us. They can heist. So we should uh, name Giant because that also covers Uro. I was naming Scout before just because I don't know why. It was easy for me to remember. Free O1. Hey, look who it is. I'm really good at this Magic the Gathering thing, you guys. You should be taking notes. Derp. Okay. Okay. <laughs> no big deal. <laughs> Not a problem. Okay. So next turn, they're going to heist the shit out of me. <laughs> Ah, uh, and I can't sunder. Okay, okay. They only get to cast one thing for free, though. Could go get Dust Bowl. Uh, also, they missed their land drop. But they threw away a land, right? No, this was three, this was four. They might have their land. If we could get rid of this. Is there a way to get rid of this? I don't think so. Not an easy one. All right, let's bring out our commander. Whenever I attack, something happens. That's pretty good. Oh, heist me. Heist me like you've never heisted me before. That's pretty good. Wait, what? What am I missing? Opponent? Maybe we're about to see extinction event. I mean, they seem confident. Moo. I see. What's the play? Ooh, what's a play? They don't have enough snow lands. They're not getting back the throne, but oh well. What are we getting back? We can just get our commander. But that's why we have to fetch first, right? Ah, uh, nah. There's got to be better. That card is what we call a problem. Do I want another O1? They might have sack effects, right? I suppose. Behold the technology. Just give me a field of the dead and we're good. Please. I, I won't say reprint field of the dead. Please unban field of the dead. Steal something good. Steal something good. Steal something good. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Between these two, bring it on. And it is... They knew. They knew. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's nice that they get me though, you know? You can cast this only if you control a legendary creature or a planeswalker.
Hero. Cool. No, come on. Nobody lets me doppelgang. How many, okay. How many hydras were we gonna make? Tap, untap, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Minus two is sixteen. Divide by three, five. Five hydras. <laughs> five forests for a billion mana. Five grenzos. <laughs> five command towers, I guess. And, uh, I don't know, <laughs> five plants, not bad. Uh, do we keep? I think we keep. Rona. Okay. Bunkles. What is going on? This must be some kind of a convoluted combo deck. I splunkle. Dust bowling for soup. We are on the move. Any new Mountain Dew flavors lately? Uh, uh, this year they launched the Laguna Lemonade Baja flavor, which I would give a solid C tier to be real, but it's temporary, so I'm enjoying while I can. And uh, they opened a Circle K in my city for the first time. So I grabbed some purple thunder. That's exciting. The power of the purple. I don't think we let our opponent have a turn of this, right? Something bad is about to happen. Although it would be fun to gain control of a Nyx Bloom Ancient. Do you think they run any re other, other reanimation or is it just Kenny? Prefontaine. Thank you for the seven months. Oh, I guess they had it right there. Okay, they've got a Nyx Bloom Ancient. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Oh, tapped land Nyx Bloom. Nothing to do with your mana? lands huh One, two, three. six is not enough I really want eight I really 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 need eight here but I don't have it do I give them a turn of Nyx Bloom Ancient because I have their Kenrith so maybe it's fine Wait a turn, go for the double. I think that's right. In the meantime, I'll try to cause some problems. Oops. Enters untapped. Okay.
Thinky, 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 don't mind me. I just have a brain that needs to do some work before it does anything cool. All right. Hold on to your butts. I'm sure this is fine. I'm sure that giving our opponent a turn with a Nyx Bloom Ancient is fine. Dark Ritual discarded. Oh god, no. Oh god, no. Please, please, go for my hand. Hand, 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 search. That's game, right? If they have a tutor there, that's probably game. I didn't have a way out of it. I didn't have a removal spell. Uh, sneak attack. I okay. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Fine. This is okay. This is fine. <laughs> this is fine. Good attack, good attack. They didn't take an extra turn yet. So I don't know if they're good at magic or not, to be honest, because that's that's what all the good decks do. <laughs> I know how your card works. I know how your card works. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Help me, chat. Cruelty and Nyx Bloom? For what? I'm gonna have three mana. No, I'm gonna have six mana. Okay. Yeah. You right. You right. I better still have my breeding pool or I'm going to have a meltdown. There it is. I told you guys, extra turn spells. Extra turn spells are the way. <laughs> That's, that is how you do it. <laughs> Today's Mesa Falcon of the day is Caleb Nelson. Caleb, your cool remember to hit join below if you want to join the mesa falcon gang and get early access to all of my videos including the worst possible commander show the brawl stuff standard you know and standards fresh and interesting anyway what can i tell you about bony paul clear cutter if you like simic and you like big creature go smash this is a very good commander it's not setting the world on fire the way that grenzo and roxanne seem to be but it's very powerful and i felt quite rewarded like i would rather play this than say goose mother a card i played a while back this feels like one of the better simic commanders in a while uh coma is another one that comes to mind as a really powerful simic commander but i think bony paul might be 
better than all. It's an excellent open queue Simic commander. So don't hold back. If you've got one of these, it's worth playing a deck like this. It's a lot of fun. Anyway, you stayed till the end of the video. That's the number one thing you can do to support the content. Appreciate you. Top it off. Hit like. Hit subscribe. Thank you for watching this video. As always, I'll see you in the next video. Let me know what commanders you want me to cover as we go through this long summer until standard rotation. Plus, we have Modern Horizons 3 commanders coming out. Let me know if there are any of those that look awesome to you. Uh, and I'll see you in the next video. You're cool.